Rick's an unlucky guy. He gets it in the head, even when he's catching the school bus. For three times, he took a picture of a parrot. The parrot bursts into flames. He stomps out the flames and kicks the parrot into the school bully's head. The school bully comes after him and pushes him down in the shit. Rick tries to wash it off with water, but he got animal sexual attracted by mistake. Dogs, squirrels, rabbits came at Rick. A dragonfly bit him on the neck. He knocked over the sexual attractant in pain. He poured a bottle over his head. Then a bunch of animals surrounded him. Alpacas, pigs, ducks, even snails. Although the super dragonfly's bite gave him superpowers. But that didn't stop his bad luck. Rick's hand was stuck to the sink. He tried to shake it off, but threw the sink at the school bully's head. Again, to Rick, the school bully's punches looked like they were coming in slow motion. He dodges the punches with these, just as he's getting the better of him. He's hit by the school bully. His mutated hand pulled off a teacher's clothes. In a panic, his hands clung to the female teacher's breasts. He even smashed the head of a man, who looked like Stephen Hawking into a hornet's nest. This boy is dancing street dance on a vertical wall. He even did the Thomas movements. He saw a van go out of control on the street. It was about to hit an old woman crossing the street. Rick pushes the old man out of the way. The van hits Rick, scattering parts all over the place. Rick walked out of the dent in the car. It wasn't hurt at all. The crowd was in disbelief. Only Rick notices the old woman had pushed into the wood chipper. Rick comes home. Uncle shoots a nail at him. Rick catches the nail with ease. He tells his uncle that he has superpowers because he was bitten by a dragonfly. Uncle didn't believe him. He stabbed Rick in the stomach with a knife, and the knife bent. But Rick didn't know how to use his powers wisely. He let the robbers go in the bank, but his uncle was shot by the robbers as a result. His uncle told him, the greater the power, the greater the responsibility. Rick wanted to know how to become a superhero. A mysterious man brought him to a superpower school. There were all kinds of superpowered people here. The head told him the secret to become a superhero was to make a costume. Rick went home and made himself a customized costume and began his journey to become a superhero.